there, welcome back to my channel, Shao here. So today's video, I want to share with you my recent empties. You know, it's been a couple of months. Some of them I really, really enjoy using. The rest is kind of like thank you next. So if you are interested, keep watching. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Cheryl, Cheryl Issa. I make videos about wellness, skincare, lifestyle, occasion, fashion related. If you're interested in all those content, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Also make sure you turn on the notification bell so you get notified whenever there's a new video. I'm just gonna like, you know, take whatever products from this bag. The first one I wanna talk about this period. Uh, Wait, what is this? It's kind of like a pad. This is by Quora. I just have this bag of products sitting in my, you know, one of those like drawers. And I stopped purchasing pads for a really long time since I started using Pure Cup. For the shape of it, it could be better, very comfortable, you know, free of fragrance, artificial dyes, chlorine. It's not something that's so extraordinary that you have to have. So I'm not planning on purchasing more pads. This one also finished. I was talking about this one recently. I bought a long time ago. At the time, I wasn't very comfortable using a menstrual disc. I want to see if it's going to work for me for the second time. And when I try to use this one again, it works definitely better than the first time I tried. I liked it. This is by Flex. I recently started using their newest. newest. You know, it's definitely lighter. It's more like bubbly. This one menstrual disc is equivalent to five super tampons. I recently purchased another one because I really enjoyed it. Cooper, we're going very soon. A foaming body scrub that I actually got from my mother-in-law, Meliora Essence Body Scrub. Oh, we thoroughly enjoy this one, finish the whole jar. It smells like spa, you know, lightly sweet. Medium hair shampoo by Way. It's looking really gross because I just left it in the shower for too long. The scent is beautiful. Love this one. But I don't see myself repurchasing it because I felt like for my hair, this is a little bit drying. So yeah, I'm not planning on repurchasing. Okay, this one. This one I talked about in my recent drugstore beauty. I really like this one. Whip soap and scrub. French lavender will finish this whole jar. Also very relaxing. So this is great, you know, exfoliate, you know, soften, moisturize, and nourish. This is just like a everyday type of multi-purpose solution. There's still some in there, but like I finished this one. So it's by Renew, Bosch and Lom. Basically, you know, this is what I use for my contact lens. This one, I've been using it for years and years. Like I can't even count how many years I've been using this one. Uh, also this toothpaste, I really like. This is by Nestor Essence, Tea Tree Oil Whitening Plus. I like that it's uh, fluoride free, SLS free, pure Australian tea tree oil. I love that. I, I think I talked about this sunscreen maybe like a long time ago. This is by Ghost Democracy, invisible lightweight daily sunscreen, brought back from SPF 33. It has 20% zinc oxide. I love when the ingredients are very mineral based. It has great ingredients, but for my, from my own experience, I felt like this is a little heavy, you know, for a mineral sunscreen. The application is not as good as the ingredients, you know. It, the application is all right, you know, it's not the best. Also by the, the same company, this is Neum Cinnamon. I like the other one, the tea tree better. This is my favorite body scrub like today. Redemption body scrub, like OMG. Body scrub, holy grail. I really absolutely love this one. So therapeutic, next level. You know, I've never used a body scrub that made me feel so relaxed and kind of like a spa atmosphere just by using this one. So I definitely see myself repurchasing this one. Like, no question, you know, I absolutely adore this product. I love a lot of products by Aesop. You know, I've used a lot of product by Aesop, but I would say so far this is one of my favorite and top recommendations. If you are intrigued about this brand, you want to try some of their products, you know, definitely try this one. Okay, I found this shop on Etsy, Creamberry Soap Co. Here, this one is chamomile and lavender whipped sugar scrub soap. Clear jar, you can't really see the product because we finished nothing left, you know, not even a drip of product. This is Brazilian bombshell, hazelnut coffee and brown sugar. No coffee grounds, which is perfect. I have gifted to people you know in my own circle and people loved it so 
This one's like almost done. A little bit left. So this is by Skin Fix. I have done a review and first impression on this product. Foaming oil cleanser. I finished this product. I absolutely adore. Um, I think it's one of the best makeup remover like on the market. Normally I just wear sunscreen and maybe a little bit like brow gel or something. It cleanses thoroughly. It doesn't dry your skin out. You know, for anybody who's intimidated of using a oil cleanser, you can start with this one. You know, I see myself repurchasing this one because it's such a great product. But if you want to know like my thoughts on the ingredients and just first impression of using it, feel free to check out the video here. This is another product looking very gross because I <laughs> <laughs> the bottle looking very gross. I left it in the shower for way too long. And Two Minds Facial Cleanser by Aesop has witch hazel, salicylic acid, and sage leaf. I love the bottle. Like, cause you know, glass, minimalist, you know, clean feel to it. Honestly, I felt like this is a little bit drying for my skin because I have combination skin type. This would be great in the summertime. I've been using this kind of like in the fall. So it was a little drying for me, depending on what skin type you have. Witch hazel, but not like too strong, you know, like witch hazel can be like your face, but this one just calming. You know, if you have acne prone skin, I think this would be a great choice. You know, I catch myself talking so fast. I normally talk slow, like I had coffee and mid, you know, I'm lightweight. I can't drink more than one cup of coffee. Like half a cup is my limit, but today I had like a cold brew, so. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos every Monday, 11ish to noon-ish. Thanks for watching. I'm Cheryl, Cheryl Issa. I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.